Elliot, Macclesfield Town surviving the Football League. What are you feeling right now? Um, elated, elated. Um, you know, I'll, I'll be honest. Um, I've had a, I've had a feeling all week that um, it was going to be, it was going to be my day. I've had a lot of people messaging me, and you now a lot of the fans message me saying, tweet me saying, um, you know, you, you're a fan's favourite. You made yourself a fan's favourite last year, but you know, go and make yourself a legend. And uh, I remember something someone said to me last last season. He said he kept saying, um, in certain situations, um, have fire in your belly but ice in your mind, and you know that stuck with me. And then, um, you know, when I went through on goal, there was no way I was missing it. You say that you've had the feeling all week that it was our day, your day. Be honest, with this times in the season where you thought this might, this day may not come. Um, yeah, personally, with the injuries that I've had, um, obviously it's been very frustrating. Um, but listen, you know, football changes so quickly. Um, you know, it changes one way, it changes another way. And, you know, I think we were 15 minutes into the second half, we, we, we couldn't have been any further away. We were 1-0 down and they were 1-0 up. And, you know, we'd have... It wasn't bad, it, it didn't bear thinking about. Um, but like I said, I'm, I've just had a feeling in my gut all week um, that it was written in the stars for me today. And, um, you know, thankfully it's, it was. As a fan, it's horrible when you see like Notts County go 1-0 up. Uh, there's nothing we can do about it on the sidelines. As a player, obviously, you know, you, you will get wind of the fact that Notts County did take the lead um, and then subsequently went behind. How do you deal with that mentally as a player? Uh, I don't think there's any way you can. Um, you know, we just have to do our job. We knew that it was in our hands. We knew it's been in our hands for a couple of weeks now. And, you know, yeah, we'd have loved to have got it over the line weeks ago but listen I don't I, I said to, to the, the news presenter a minute ago I don't really think there's a better way to do it you know mm. in front of your home fans packed out crowd uh, going one behind mm. knowing Notts County were winning mm. um, it was just a, it was just a special day and like I said I've, I've I've had that feeling all week it was written in the stars for me to do that and um, you know I'm just I'm over the moon in many ways you said your relation you feeling now in many ways is it similar to that you felt this time last year uh, it's 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 obviously different, very different. But I'm I'm not really one to, you know. I I, I said weeks ago oh, I'm not really going to celebrate staying up because I think you know I don't think we should be in this situation. But you know, um, it's changed today. I'm going to enjoy it. You know, it's. I hope it's my last ever relegation battle. I don't want to ever be in a relegation battle again. Um, but you know, I'm. I think this is why I play football. You know, for days like today and. Um, uh, you know, I think we've got everything we deserve today. I know it sounds daft, but do you find out more about yourself as a player, yourself as a as a bloke, in a relegation scrap than you maybe do in a promotion battle? Yeah, you know, I think in a in a in a promotion battle, um, you know, everything goes right. Um, you know, you're winning. You know, the general the changing room tends to run itself. The team mm. tends to run itself. You know, you. You don't tend to get many injuries. You spin it when you're in a relegation battle. All those go polar opposite mm. for you. So, you know, you find a lot about yourself. You find a lot about um, your teammates. Um, you know, and a lot of things have been said. You know, we've had we've had we've had a lot of bad press this season um, mm. for whatever reason. You know, individuals. Um, you know, as a team, and you know, we've batted them all away. Mm. You know, we've had a lot of. It's well documented the the um, the issues off the field that we've had to deal with. You know we've batted it away, um, and we've just tried, and you know we've succeeded in dealing with things that we were able to control. Mm. And that was as soon as we walked over that white line. That's something we can control. Never in doubt when that ball dropped to you in front of the star lane, was it? Never in doubt. You know I knew as soon as it left my foot, um, I was going to score. And like I said, it was uh, it was uh, a fire in the belly, ice in the mind, and that that'll stick with me for the rest of my career.